According to the latest data from television watchdog Ofcom, Love Island has been slapped with 1,049 complaints over the past fortnight. On July 9, which was the reality dating show's highly anticipated movie night, a total of 957 complaints were lodged to Ofcom. On June 30, 92 people complained to the regulator about the hit ITV2 program which is hosted by Ma Yajama. An Ofcom spokesperson said of the most recent influx of complaints, the majority of complaints related to alleged bullying towards Scott Fonderslush from the other islanders. They said of the June complaints, complaints related to contestant Molly Marsh being reintroduced to Kosim or having been eliminated from the program the previous week. Susanna Reed brand Strictly Come Dancing Boss's snobby overban, video, this appeared in last week's report and the total number of complaints on this issue is now 466. Love Island fans tuned into movie night on Sunday evening as the cast finally got to see what everyone really got up to in Cosa Moore. The girls and boys went head to head to answer questions, with the team closest to the correct answer winning the chance to choose which explosive clip to watch. Don't miss! Love Island viewers beg producers to step in over pathetic twist, update, Love Island's Katie and Savage to get Tyreek and Della's relationship, must see, strictly come dancing sign up Love Island star for first time, latest, they were given the options of, the Mitch and the wardrobe, double Sammy, some like it Scott, wild wild Jess, friends with benefits, and the full Montel. The first anticipated feature was for Ella Thomas who had gotten close to Uzi C during her time in Cosa Amor, despite being closed off with original Islander Tyreek Hyde. Cleverly titled Cinderella, the clip showcased her massage from Uzi as Tyreek A watched on looking irate. Later on, when Catherine Ogbaje and Scott Vandersloos clips were shown, a row between the groups unfolded as the girls said none of them wanted Scott in Cosa more. He clapped back at Leah Taylor saying she had appointed herself as spokesperson despite saying nothing for four weeks. Love Island continues tonight at 9pm on ITV2 and ITVX.